Hi guys, welcome to AK module five for loops. For step one, we have to go walk source main java com et and right here checkout machine. The part is right here on the right side. Work source main java com at checkout machine dot java. After that, we have to go to we have to create the, our code between the two command means like this one and this one. So it's right here. Create a for loop that goes through the whole weight array. So for loop integer i initialization zero. I will then dot when I increment one open curly drag drag. After that, um, let's see. Within the for loop, do the following: create a local variable of type weight call. Flow call weight to store the value of weight at a specific index. So look at variable call. Flow call weight one. So we're gonna declare float variable call weight and to store the value of weight. We just need to add right here at a specific index. So weight. In the after that, create a conditional that check whether weight is n of 20 and whether hash loyalty cut is true. So, conditional statement start with if I if okay, weight is less than 20. I'm gonna open curly bracket. If it's true, we have to multiply weight by 0.95. So weight as rate equal to 0.95. We can write like this, or the other one is um, like this. We multiply by so point nine five, whichever is fine. I choose line nineteen, so I'm gonna just comment. Okay, if it's true, we're gonna return the to the wave. So add weight to to the weight the variable. So to the weight equal to um, slash equal to. Anything you can write like this if you want. Wait, try to do wait, wait. So basically, 921 and 22 is the same meaning, it has the same meaning. So I'm gonna command it and I will leave line 22 here and. We have to run our code to check if it's true. Run workflow that zero one. Okay. 
So you see bills so so full. Sometimes the bill fill because of the open and close curly bracket here. So like you see here, should be one, two, three, four open curly bracket, and then one, two, three, four close curly bracket. So for the for loop, we have open bracket here and close bracket here. For the if statement, we have open bracket here and close bracket here. You see it's match the square box. And for return statement, we have a curly close curly bracket here. And line 12, we have a open curly bracket here for the, our class calculate weight. And then at last we have Close curly bracket on line 27 and open curly bracket on line 3 for the class checkout machine. To that, we're going to go to um, step 2 troubleshooting. So it should be this one walk, source, main, Java, com, ATA, and the second one right here. You can see if you're in the right spot. Check out machine troubleshoot.java. Check out machine troubleshoot.java. If that's so, oh, it's say um, you have finished your program to calculate the to the way off and away away from the first activity. You decided to take a break. You go grab a cup of coffee before going back to work. When you get back, you see your cat playing around with your keyboard. You ran over quickly and see that your cat has messed up your code. Can you face what your cat did to your code? Okay. So, and then it say uh, we have a checkout machine troubleshoot class. There is a main method that can be run to test out the calculate weight method. You can update weight and has to the cat to include any value you want to test out. Once you have added value you want to test, click on the run button to test out your value and changes. You will see the tool, tool you will see the test to a weight and follow by the tool weight. Okay, let's try to fix it. This is the same thing that we create on step one. So we have a class here, check out machine troubleshoot. We have a flow giggly weight, flow weight, Boolean value here. And we declare flow to the weight equal to zero. And for initialization, I zero, I less than, it look fine. Flow weight equal to weights I, if weight is under two F, it's not two F, I'll cut mass up. So we put 20 F and has loyalty cut. F means float and has logic. If this statement, if statement is true, we're gonna execute our code here. Weight multiply equal to so 0.95. We can add flow here too if we want. After that, we have to the weight here to the weight equal to total weight plus weight, right? So here we work at mess up our plus, so we just put plus. It look fine, fine. We have a statement close and open bracket, all loop statement, open and close bracket, and return statement for our quickly wait bracket. Uh, after that, we have here public main stated. Um, we have a flow way here. If you want, you can change your weight to like um, 10 F um, and then 30 F. 10 F, we're gonna get discount like 5% to the weight, right? And then 30 F, and right here, you can add maybe 90 F. And Boolean has really care. We're gonna leave it as it. And then we will run our run button. Let's say um, 
click on the run button, but I didn't see run button on our Bulgarian. So I'm gonna just use the run walk to run command to check our output. Okay, it say right here on the right to the weight colon followed by to to the weight. So in your terminal, you can see to the weight is one thirty. Um, you can test again like uh, you can change ten ten. You can do like this one, maybe twelve, and this one maybe thirty, and run again. To see if our code really output the result that we want. So right now it changed because we changed the weight. So to the weight, the total is 52. And then it show us the float value, like 52.0. Okay, after that, you can go to um, run. Flow step zero two to check if your code is working and build successful. Seems like everything is working. The final step we have to run walk through test all. So run walk through test all. Everything is successful, so we're gonna just submit our walk here. Grading, grading. Okay, I'm gonna stop my video here. Green seem like it take a while. Thank you so much, guys.